The final step in the Berlin criteria is evaluating something called the PF ratio. That stands for PaO2, which is the partial pressure of oxygen in the arteries, and FiO2, which is the fraction of inspired oxygen. Essentially what we're asking is how much of the oxygen that we're giving is actually making it into the patient's blood. Let me show you a cool experiment. Now there's nothing I love more than a nice glass of bourbon with some oak notes to it. And so I got this cocktail chimney from my friend Chris Graceffa, and it's pretty cool. So what I'm going to do is take some of these oak wood chips and put it into the mesh here. And then I'm going to use a torch and heat those up. Now as it begins to smoke, it builds up positive pressure above the solution, which in this case is bourbon. And my goal is to build up that pressure above the solution enough that that smoke actually diffuses into the bourbon. Because eventually I gotta take that fog top off of it and I want some of it to still be inside the bourbon. So this reminded me of the PF ratio. If you imagine the FiO2 is the smoke and you're asking how much of this actually made it in here. And I guess in that example, you could also say that the fog top is kind of like your peep. All right, so let's pretend that we do an arch stick on me. We draw an ABG while I'm breathing 21% oxygen, and we look at my PaO2. Now, that number normally is going to be somewhere between 80 and 100. And a down and dirty way of estimating what a PaO2 should be for a given FiO2 is just multiplying it by 5. So let's do it for the atmospheric oxygen. 21 times 5 is 105. So if my PaO2 is 105 or 100, somewhere in that range, that means everything is working efficiently, right? I don't have a thickened membrane in my alveoli. I don't have gunk in my lungs. I don't have atelectasis. Everything is, is flowing well. But imagine if my PaO2 is 105, but I was on 50% oxygen. What would my PaO2 be if I was on 50% oxygen and I had nice clean diffusion in my lungs? That's right, it would be 250, but it's only 105. So you can see there's a discrepancy there. And that's where the PF ratio comes in. What you do is you take the PaO2, which for me is 105, and you divide it by what the FiO2 is, which is 50%. That comes out to be 210. So where does that fit on the severity of my art? Let's take a look. All right, so let's look at the severity scale for art. So mild is going to be between 200 and 300. Moderate is 100 to 200. And severe is anything less than 100. But here's the thing. You have to make sure that they're on at least five of PEEP just to make sure that it's not atelectasis that could easily be reversed by giving them a little bit of peep. So where did I sit? Wasn't it like 210? So I would be mild ARDS according to the PF ratio with the Berlin definition.